Hello, Georgie Burns back again. Um, today I'm going to show you how I made this card. Nothing special about this card. It's just got a flap with a magnet. Um, and just a message inside. There's no sentiment on it and I should have added a bit of paper there but I forgot. Um, because I didn't know what sentiment to put on it. I still don't. But I can add one if I want to use the card. So, to make this card I just use Quiet Meadow and I use this flower image here. And I cut off a little bit of the stalk because I didn't want it all. For cards I've got Fresh Freesia, 8 and a quarter by 5 and 7 eighths, scored at 4 and 1 eighths. A piece of white card, I've got two pieces of white card at 5 and 5 eighths by 3 and 7 eighths, one for the inside, one for the outside. I've got some pansy paper left over, so I'm going to use this. And this is 5 and a half by 3 and 3 quarters. That's going to go on there. I have a piece of Fresh Freesia, that is two and a quarter by three and three quarters. So this one will be two and one eighth by three and five eighths. And that just goes over like that, which will sit there. And I have this, which is an inch by roughly six inches. We more than likely will chop a little bit off. And I will have, once I separate them, two magnets. Right. Two magnets, magnets separated. And we'll also need some glue dots. I wonder where they are. Hang on, let me find my glue dots. Thought I'd lost them. Well, there are not many left on there. Alright, so first off, let's glue all these together. Um, no, let's not glue all these together. But I can glue this on. That's the front on. And this will have to go on. And then this goes on top of that. Like so. And that will fold over. So, let's do our stamping first. Um, I have my flower here. I need a little bit of masking tape. Because I'm going to mask off the bottom of this. Because I don't want all the flower, all this on the bottom. Right. 
and cup. And stamp this down. I think I've gone down. Yeah. Paper's too high up. Oh, the tape's too high up. So let's do it again. Put this down. That's it. Do it again. I wish I could hold this properly, but it's too big for my little hands. That's okay. Just need some pens out. Right, we definitely need a green and let's do a blue. So we've got seaside spray and a lighter seaside spray. So I'll do the old olive first. Cover all these leaves and stems in. Had a busy week this week. Car in for its MOT, blood tests, haircuts. Going to my daughter's on Sunday for Sunday lunch for Mother's Day. Up by the seaside. She got the logo a couple of weeks ago. I haven't seen her since. Bless her. From a little school child, because she works at school. My grandson, who's four, he has it now as well. Picked it up at nursery. He lives in Scotland. I 
and his brother, bless him, was covered in chicken pox. But I'm quite surprised Bentley never got chicken pox. Oh, I was going to do them a bit darker, wasn't I? Never mind. I've got a stem. Just putting in a bit of by the bottom, or should I say by the middle, just to make it a bit darker and Daffodils are light in the middle. There we are. Who would think of blue with? Fresh freesia, that actually looks quite nice. Oh no, I don't want that there. Right. To bring this back, I need to glue this down in the middle of the card. I'm going to glue it there and now I'm going to glue this on top of it so you can't see it And then we're going to bend that over like that because this will stick on top like that. So six inches is about the right size. So I want that in the middle. So I am going to just put a bit of glue on there, push it down like that, and then I'm going to place this where I want it, like that. Now, for my two and one. I'm going to put them on remember which side I've got to do it so them off the glue dot and place that there. Put that one on top and then I'm going to put that down and lift them up. 
then I'm going to put that over the top. So. fuzzy bit on the card. Right, and place that. On there like that. And now we've got the outside to put on. Bit of glue around the magnet. Glue it now. Hide the magnet, and there you have your card. You could put sentiment across the bottom here. I would, when I do the sentence, I would sentiment. I would put it there. I hope you like that card. If you do, give us a thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of my cards, please subscribe, and if you press the bell icon. You'll be notified of any more videos I upload, which is usually a Monday and a Friday. All I can say is thanks for visiting and I hope to see you again soon.